Good morning, everyone. It's Miss Peggy, and here's Jesus, and we're here to hear our story for today. This week, our story is from the Bible. It's from the Old Testament and the book of Judges. This story is about a lady named Deborah. God's people had been captured by an enemy. They prayed to God, Please, God, help us get our land and our freedom back. God listened, and he sent a woman named Deborah to help them. Deborah was a judge and was very wise and very faithful to God. She gave people messages from God and helped people talk about their arguments. Every day, Deborah sat under a palm tree, and men and women who had problems came to her for help. So it was her job to help people work through their disagreements. If someone gets angry at another person, like if you have a toy that you're playing with and someone takes it and, and you get into an argument with your friend, someone like Deborah can help you decide how to take turns with the toy and how to share and how to be friends again. That was a very important job that God had given her, wasn't it? One day, God gave Deborah a very important message a message that would help free the people of Israel. Deborah gave God's message to a man named Barak. She told him, God said, take 10,000 men and go to Mount Tabor. God will help you defeat the king's army and the Israelites will be free. Wow, that was an important message. I wonder if Barak listened to her. Barak said, I'll do this, but I'll need your help. Will you go with me? Deborah, who was as brave as she was wise, agreed to go. She knew that God would be with her every step along the way. Barak and Deborah took 10,000 men to Mount Tabor. There was an awful battle. Yelling and screaming and fighting went on. The noise was so loud and so terrible. But God was always with Deborah and the Israelites, protecting them and keeping them safe. It was a very hard fight, but finally Barak and the Israelites won. God helped them defeat the king's army, and there was peace for the people once again. There's the picture of the big battle. Wow. Looks like there's a lot of angry people there, doesn't it? So Deborah was a very brave and a very wise woman. And she listened to God, and she accepted all the things that God asked her to do, and she did her very best to make them happen. She was very loyal to God. Sometimes it's hard to hear what God's saying to us. Sometimes we have to listen very closely to hear what God wants. But God has a plan for us. God knows where we're going and what's going to happen in our lives, and he wants us to be happy and healthy and he wants us to be very successful. So all we have to do is open up our hearts and open up our ears and listen to what God has to say to us. I promise you, if you do that, he will send you on the right path. Would you like to say a prayer with me? Okay. Dear God, thank you for always listening to us when we talk to you. We promise that we will do our best to listen to you too and to follow the path that you give us. Amen. All right. Well, everyone have a good week, and I'll see you next time right here with Jesus. Take care. Bye-bye.